Hello, this is Frater Ralph with Hermetic Temple Arts. And on this channel, what I plan to do is just share little arts and crafts ideas, as well as other ideas pertaining to temple life and ritual practice and really what have you. Today, what I'm going to do on our channel is show you how we fix candles for our, uh, our altar setup. And what we do, what I'm showing here is a glass vase that holds a seven-day candle insert. And this is the empty insert here. And uh, we buy these at the Catholic bookstore. And they're called the Cathedral Seven-Day Candles. And what you do, this is one that's burned out. This is one that's brand new. And uh, as you can see, it's got a little plastic sleeve. And inside there is your beeswax candle. And if you just burn it as is, what you get is about a seven day burn on these candles. Now what we do in order to get a little more burning time out of them is that I will add consecrated oil. And uh, you can use any kind of oil you want. You can use scented oil. What I do is our consecrated oils that we use at Temple of the Infinite Universe here are uh, also usually scented oils. And we'll add our little own spices to it or essential oils. And so this has a double effect. When you add oil to a candle like this, it'll increase the burning time and it also adds a scent to the smell of the candle as you burn it and it also creates a special charge around your candle, a, a special consecration. Like now this oil here that I'm using uh, it's, it's not marked but it's uh, just our regular al uh, altar oil which is an olive oil base and I also add a little bit of uh, rose oil to it so it has a nice smell of essential rose oil. And what I do is I will slowly add the consecrated oil to it. And this I do slowly because the oil doesn't always absorb into the candle that fast. So what we're going to do is just kind of wait a little bit. I don't know if you can see it slowly descending. Well, I can't really zoom in much more than that. But this usually takes about two or three minutes to gradually add your oil to the candle and then wait so it doesn't overflow, of course. And what we're doing is we're letting the, the oil settle down to the bottom of the candle. It's already down to about this level. And now it's filling up to about there. Add a little bit more. There we go. Got one of our cats knocking on the outside wanting to come in. It's cold and rainy outside and they don't want to be out in it any more than I do. Now we've almost got this candle filled up. It's up to, we've still got an air pocket down here I see. I'm going to add a little bit more. Oh boy, there we are. I think that's about got it. I'm going to wait. A little bit more. Make sure we got that completely filled. This is a candle that we have dedicated to Saint Cipriano. And he is a patron saint of those who practice magic and miracle workers. He's one of our favorite saints around the Temple of the Infinite Universe. And there we have it. I think we've got it about set. So what we have here right now is we have a candle, a seven day candle that's completely filled now with uh, special olive oil. And what this does is in effect it adds a special charge to the candle and it also increases the burning time from roughly seven days to nine days. 
So if you want uh, a good nine-day votive candle, which is safe to allow to burn continuously, just go down to your uh, closest Catholic bookstore, ask for the cathedral candle inserts, and you may also want to pick up a glass sleeve to put it in. And this is still, still needing a little bit more oil. And you can buy these candles for roughly $2.80 to $3 each. Our local bookstore sells them for $2.85, I believe. And undoctored, unmessed with, it'll burn seven days. Uh, doctored up like this, it will burn for nine days. Now that is completely full. So I'm now going to put that down into the candle sleeve. And we got a nice rosy pink candle sleeve that is housing a votive candle that is full of special oil that has been scented with rose oil. So it's kind of a neat combination. And then you light it. And it, it burns perfectly with the oil. It just adds a little extra fuel, among other things, to the uh, candle wax. And when you're burning it off, you have the added intention here of a candle that's been charged for a specific purpose. In, in this case, uh, charged to uh, St. Cipriano and also uh, bearing the energy of love and devotion. And you can use this for basically any purpose that you wish. You can charge it for prosperity, health, uh, healing, wellness, whatever your particular need is. And again, this is a good way to take a seven-day candle and turn it into a nine-day votive candle. So uh, that's all for today. This is Frater Ralph signing off and wishing you a blessed evening ahead. Thank you.